Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming. Uh, I hope that everyone had a fantastic festive period off and that your new year has started off in the right way. Now this week we are going to be doing another Forzathon weekly challenge uh, and in this one it wants you to use the 1958 Austin Healy Sprite Mark II to complete all of its challenges. So it's a bright and bubbly old school car and it'll set you back about 20,000 credits so there's the car in question it's the one that always looks happy I mean look at it it's just happy it's weird but it's, it's got a smiley face man um, but it will literally set you back about 20,000 credits from the auto show so nice and cheap um, I've also created a tune for you guys to use for it. So it's an S2 class pack in 668 brake horsepower uh, and you can find it just by typing in fastest EVG. Now the first challenge here wants you to earn five drafting skills uh, whilst racing your Austin Healy. Now for this one I just went to the Moorhead wind farm circuit but you can use any track, any course, it doesn't matter what it is, uh, it's entirely down to yourself. Now obviously I hopped in solo and just picked the standard three lap race. Now drafting skills can only only be earned during races uh, and of course I'm sure we all know what a drafting skill is it's where you're just sort of following closely behind uh, another AI driver tar or you can do it online as long as you're in the Austin Healy it doesn't matter and it doesn't matter what difficulty you're on so as long as you're following a car you'll probably get four drafting skills straight away uh, from normal drafting all the way up to ultimate drafting and then all you need is one more drafting skill and there's five of them completed in literally about 30 seconds to a minute it shouldn't take much longer uh, and then you can either complete the race or you can just hop out and quit because you'll have completed the challenge by then it's entirely down to yourself at the end of the day but the first challenge is a nice quick and easy one now the next one just wants you to take the Austin Healy out for a 10 mile drive so for this as per usual I just headed up the motorway uh, and all you have to do is keep on driving until the challenge pops up now the good thing is because I've tuned this one um, it will max out about 190 mile an hour which isn't incredibly fast but it's fast enough and it'll help you get the challenge done in about five minutes all you have to do is sprint up and back down the motorway uh, and by that point you'll have completed 10 miles because it's a minimum of five miles in each direction basically so that not really a challenge but nice and easy one there to complete the second part of this week's forza thumb not too difficult at all uh, <clears throat> now the final one just wants you to score a total of six stars uh, from speed zones now this is another nice and easy one and i recommend using the forest green speed zone now the reason is to get three stars on this you only have to hit 90 mile an hour uh, and that's very very easy especially in this tuned up uh, sprite mark one and it basically means that all you have to do is two runs of the speed zone um, to complete this challenge to get three stars each way and there's your six stars complete now it doesn't matter if you only get one or two stars for example you can do it as many times as you have to in order to get the six stars but doing two sort of one each way takes about 30 seconds each way so it's about a minute to complete this challenge so all in all it's a nice quick and easy falls on there shouldn't take you any more than 10 minutes in this car like I said, it's pretty easy, pretty simple, and a great way to start off the new year. Now, while we're on a topic of starting off the new year in the right way, um, I hope that you've all entered the 100 million credit giveaway. So I'm gonna be doing two winners, each winner earning 50 million credits each. The results will be announced on the 5th of January. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Uh, if you click on my previous video, I'll put a link in the description that will take you to the giveaway video and it will tell you all you need to do. In essence, just got to make sure you're subscribed, uh, preferably with notifications on so you can see the winner announcement video. Um, you can like the video if you want, but you have to comment down below on what your favourite racing game of all time is make sure it's on that video and not this one otherwise it won't count uh, but i wish everyone the best of luck and like i said before i hope you had a fantastic christmas and your new year has got off in the right way but a massive thank you for everyone's support hope to see you soon take care